The following trailer is rated H for honest. In an era when movie tie-in games were synonymous with total garbage fires, experience a superhero title that bucked the trend and went down in history as a classic by doing just two simple things. Mostly ignoring the movie and giving even the tiny sh** about the gameplay. Spider-Man 2. Play the game based on the best of the Sam Raimi Spider-Man movies. No, not that one. Where you'll swing effortlessly from building to building, stylishly put evil in its place, have the exact same evil pop up again 47 times, and still act surprised when Spider-Man shows up. Hey, what's with all the webs? I'm criming over here! Don the ridiculous bodysuit of Peter Parker, a massive nerd hit by a spider full of science magic that gave him super strength, super speed, super quips. I'm gonna take a wild guess that you're strong but dumb. Super sticky hands and super disgusting wrist glands that produce an alarming amount of goo. Then join his quest to rid his city of evil by taking on a rogues gallery of suited weirdos like Fishbowl Head, dresses like a rhinoceros guy, and melted candle Alfred Molina until you discover your true nemesis, a balloon you can never seem to reach. Get back here, you rubber asshole! Discover the web-swinging action that sets Spider-Man 2 apart from the crowd as you zip your way around the streets of New York with a traversal system that's smooth as spider silk, despite making you actually web off the buildings and not the moon. Then realize that the movement is the source of 90% of your nostalgia, and the rest of the game is a short by the numbers beat em up stretched into an acceptable length by repetitive side missions and a mostly empty open world. But hey, at least the swinging never gets old. Whee! I'm Spandex Tarzan! Blast your way through Spider-Man 2's endless cavalcade of muggers and thieves as you chain together punches, kicks, and wrist jizz to juggle your foes, stun them with counters and Spidey Sense bullet time, and generally just beat ass. Then chill out for a bit with some less violent challenges, like time trials, pizza delivery, catching a falling guy, taking some pictures, and to complete the Spider-Man experience, getting yelled at by J.K. Simmons. I don't have time for your moral outrage, Parker. So let Spider-Man 2 swing its way into your heart today with a movie tie-in game that won't make you want to rake the flesh from your face. Then join me in prayer that the new one also won't suck, because I'm already seeing a worrying amount of quick-time event buttons. Don't you dare f us up, Insomniac! Starring Rhinoplasty, Kitty Titties, Triple J, Two in the Pink, 80 Sci Fi Man, The Dankest Girlfriend, Dr. Squidward, and Arachlad, Spider in the City. You know, this game's alright and all, but I'm still waiting for someone to take a chance and give him the full spider treatment. Eight legs, eight eyes, and 10,000 tiny children. You voted from 24 of the greatest franchises. Now the people have spoken, and it's down to these final four survivors. Mega Man, Danganronpa, Infamous, and Spyro. Vote on Facebook and Twitter with the hashtag HGTVote for the title you think should take HGT Gauntlet Greatness. May the best game win. Comment below on what you want me to read in my epic voice. Would you kindly get stepped on by a big daddy? I have crippling depression because I saw Boku no Pico. Let's give it everything we've got. It's punishment time. In a world where no one has an anus, we all flow down here, Georgie.